We're here at the opening of the stagecoach Adam Stansfield stand. It's quite impressive, isn't it? It is. It is. looks fantastic. Um, long time coming, but I think everyone's looking forward to getting, getting bums on seats and, and people in the stand and, and watching football. I suppose it's an example of how far the club's come in the past. Definitely. We, we say time and time again about where the, the investment goes in terms of this club and it's back into the club. And uh, facilities like this uh, just help the club along in terms of sort of uh, showing the way we're going, to be honest with you. Um, the club's moving forward. The away stand will be open at some stage in the next month or two as well. And, and all of a sudden we've got a, a ground we can be proud of. And on towards uh, this weekend, how is the situation fitness-wise? Um, a few little knocks and niggles, obviously Haram um, had a scan today so we'll get the results in the next couple of days. Look, he's, he's definitely out of this weekend and it could be a substantial period of time so we'll wait on the, the results from Haram's injury. Um, but Jaden's getting closer to, to full fitness after a bit of an illness. Um, there's a few tired bodies and a few people under the weather on the back of Saturday, Tuesday. So we'll see how they are tomorrow and the next 24, 48 hours going into the weekend. We need as many bodies fit as we possibly can. And But I'm sure anyone we put out on pitch this weekend will, will represent the club in the right manner and, and attack the game properly. And it's Forest Green this Saturday. What have you made of their start to the season? Good start. I think they've only been beaten once. Um, really showed up the sort of maybe a bit of fragility from last couple of seasons um, and some good attacking players as well. So obviously we watch the footage as we always do. Um, good attacking team could could threaten us on the counter attack and in certain areas of the pitch. So we've got to be got to be right at it come Saturday. Look, I was pleased with the performance on Tuesday. Um, to get to get a point against a team in form, it would be really yes, flew at us yes, for the first yes, 70 minutes yes, or so. Yes, yes. Um, was pleasing. We've got to take those performances from the last couple of away games into a home form and hopefully we can pick up a result. So it really kicked on this season after last year and going by the matches last year, exciting. Could be an exciting yeah. <laughs> Roller coaster, weren't they? You know, we, we played them about seven times last year in all the FA Cup games and the replays um, and the, the game called off as well. So we know each other pretty well, but it's different personnel. You know, it, we've said this time and time again, different players, different staff. Um, and it'll be a different scenario situation come Saturday afternoon. Um, we want as many people here as, as possible to get behind us. And like I say, our home form has been good. We want to reward those people with a, a decent performance. You mentioned the FA Cup there. What are your reaction to uh, George Blackpool in the first round? Uh, tough draw. You know, we, you, you, it's a difficult one because you want a, not an easy tie, but you want ones you can qualify straight forward um, in the first couple of rounds and get a big club in the third round. So look, it's, it's a tough one. The, the, the bonus is at home. So we'll fly into that game. Um, it would be a good opportunity for, for, for the players to really showcase their abilities against a team in the higher league. So we're looking forward to that. But we, you know, we, we always say we take one game at a time, and that's obviously this weekend, and that's going to be a, a tough game. Cheers.